right, and we are back with some more uh, nostalgia November shenanigans. Um, probably going to be playing and trying to complete this game. Um, okay. Yeah, in the moon, as you can see. Why not? We'll stay a night. It's funny because I'm staying in a hotel as we speak. <laughs> I always like to have three angels per Angel's prayers at any given time. And we'll do a healing breeze. This tune is... This tune is... like memory projection happening. <laughs> if female is missing, please look for her. Until we find her, this place is closed. Okay. I'm a son of the most wealthy house in this town. Yeah. Come on, I'll treat you to spirits. Well, don't worry about money. It's on me. I'm a rich man. Yeah. You are Dran, aren't you? Indeed. Do you know him? Yes. If he is my old acquaintance, this must be Bale 20 years ago. What? weapons failed 20 years ago but they, get, they got all the uh, up-to-date weapons <laughs> okay. <clears throat> becomes powerful inversely to HP oh I see so if your HP is lower it it um the attack power goes up? Okay. Nullifies damage due to thunder-based attacks. Holy crap, that's a big spike in uh, resistance as well. Magical defense power. Oh my gosh, I mean, we gotta have that for Miranda, right? Ah, we'll come back. <laughs> um, I'm not sure. I can't remember. This is the... Oh, it is. Yep. I understand that this place is not what it appears to be, but where are we now? A world behind the wall. It seems as if the labyrinth of the moon is not refusing us. No, almost as if it's maybe inviting us. Minintos, it seems this place belongs to them. I 
think they're the 99th species. Maybe they can tell us something about this place? The Psyche is creating this world. This time, it's whose heart, whose intention. Is it you? Or maybe, or maybe me, huh? Oh yeah, I can't. Can't carry any more items. Alright. Can we um discard discard a body purifier? Okay. Okay. <clears throat> All right. You don't seem to be one of the Menintos. Look at her closely. It's the girl in the room we came from. Oh. She's the girl who disappeared into the wall, isn't she? Hi, what are you doing here? Dart! This girl doesn't know about you yet. What are you talking about? Let me go now. She is Claire. She is inviting me. Sorry, but please wait for me here. Hashel! Hashel was right. The girl was inviting Hashel, not you. You can only wait for him. Okay, but as with Miranda, what's going on in the moon? Claire. Is it you, Claire? It's me, your father. Don't come here, I hate you, Dad. Claire? Always, always strict discipline. What can I use such a thing for? The power to destroy? The power to hurt people? I don't need such power. I strictly disciplined you since you were little. I only had you. I had to hand my art, this ancestral art, down to the next generation. It's not fair. I just want to sing songs, chit-chat with my friends, pick flowers, and fall in love. <laughs> Our art was never meant to hurt people. It is a martial art to give life to people. Please understand. I don't understand. All right. Alright, so we're gonna have a flashback sequence, get some fighting in with some dialogue. Do you remember the first time we matched wills? You read my movement in a blink and went on the offensive with swiftness. It was an innate art. <clears throat> I don't think so. I'm just a girl, like the ones you can find anywhere. No, you can surpass me. Nobody has been charmed by the war god as much as you. Your hidden power. Uh, it's not. It's hot inside my body. Dad, help me. Somebody is taking me. C Claire, what's wrong? Yeet! Alright. <laughs> yeah, the ch dialogue is super cheesy, but. <laughs> um. I mean, am I just supposed to, like, guard here? Try attacking. Let's see. Yes, 
Ah, crap. Ah, crap. I keep forgetting about that. Uh, alright. I hate you, Dad. You did this to my body. It's your fault, Dad. No, it's impossible. The transmigration of the War God. Is she demonized? Incredible. Nobody has ever reached that level except the Founder. What the hell was that? Oh. I just die? What? The black art of... Nagaru Juna? <laughs> Four gods destruction? How'd you player learn? So this is like him... seeing... A monster that that he like potentially creates or something. <laughs> By uh, like repelling her to learn martial arts and forcing her to do it. I am the war god. I preside over the art of war and beckon death. It was your desire to awaken me. I am the answer to your long quest. No, you are my Claire. You're not the war god. Leave from the body of my Claire. I can hear it's the pain voice of Claire. Hang in there, I'm coming to save you. God damn it. <laughs> oh man, the voice lines are like so poorly executed too, it's like, it's so bad. <laughs> Alright. Ah oh, crap. I'm rusty. your art down to my very core. How can I exercise this? Being obsessed by martial arts has made my precious daughter endure this suffering? Forgive me. Ah! Uh... 
I guess I'm supposed to pick the other option then. <clears throat> it's a good thing without guard about guarding in this game is like you eventually just slowly regain HP because it halves the damage. I don't care about myself. I have to save my daughter, Claire. I'll focus all my body and soul into this and kill that devil that possesses my Claire. Oh, actually blocked it. Thank you, Dad. Forgive me, Claire. Ashel, is it over? Ashel, you also saw the past? Yes, I did. But the past wasn't as bitter as I imagined. It seems everything, both the future and past, are filled in this moon future when the world will be destroyed and our past both Miranda and Hashel were made to see the past by the moon right they see as I told you we are in reality it's not illusion maybe they can do it because they're the 108th species and gods let's move on we wasted lots of time going to be our team, I think. Yeah, if we just keep moving this way, do we... Okay. Looks like we still get some random encounters in here. gets me every time, dude. I don't know what it is. It's like... Alright. Tighten this. Tighten this down. And there it is again. Ah, <laughs> oh, almost had it. Oh. Hmm. Oh, okay, it's a dead end. Interesting. Guess what, we work our way back to that initial area, and then... Uh, probably confront Albert's past, I think? Let's, uh... So we got two of these, let's use them. <clears throat> uh, oh, this isn't a multiplier one. <laughs> Alright. 
now I'm like bracing for the the counter attack. Oh my god, dude! I am not. <laughs> what is? How am I not nailing these additions? Like I've. Oh man. Okay. So we work our way back. So we're getting some practice. Addition practice. <clears throat> Make our way back. And we can buy some items when we're back. Oh, yep, that way is open now, so... <clears throat> okay. Might as well save it while we're here. Okay, and now this way. <clears throat> Emperor Duel took the throne and at last we have peace in this country. Now, His Majesty Duel is on an expedition to the home of Gigantos. Please come another time. Now, oh, okay, yep. I will be a knight who protects this country. <clears throat> okay. What is this? The ground is so far away. Are we floating in air? You can stand up. Seems there is an invisible floor. <laughs> Are we really in the sky? Oh yeah, there's an invisible floor. Nothing to be worried about. Looks like it, because this is a cloud. Even I've never been in such a high place. Really, anything can happen. Don't just look at the view forever, we are moving on. Okay. Got some weird enemies here. Okay. Yes. 
Way. Dun 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 dun. Uh, Miranda's still got that status effect on her. Seems to be affecting her damage output too. Leveled up. Wow. Normally, uh, you don't really level up from random encounters because they're the boss XP is just so massive in this game. That is. Oh no, Michael. No, I couldn't have been mistaken. I was with him for more than ten thousand years. Is that your dragon rose? It was the vassal dragon. My dragon. That's what I asked you. <laughs> Run! Oh, okay. They're not around here. Start in rows. They should be fine like us. Of course, it's impossible for them to die from just an attack of a dragon. <clears throat> she called it Maiko. <laughs> Why did Rose's vassal dragon attack us? This is just my guess, but in the moon, I think some sort of feeling that exists in our heart materializes itself. You mean Rose had some caring feelings for her vassal dragon? I flew around here and don't you think this place seems like the home of Gigantos? Yes, but this was old Holy Land long long ago. <laughs> There's one hiding down here. Don't miss even one. Annihilate all Gigantos. Hey, Duel's coming. Run! be no one to devastate the holy land of the Gi Gigantos ever. But your majesty do well. We may be too late. Only if your majesty Carlo gives us permission to dispatch. Don't talk about him. He is no longer alive. Your majesty do well. There's something in here. Come out. A Giganto child... I'm the new king of Sir Dio, Dewell. There are no more people to persecute you. 
You can live in peace from now on. What's your name? Human, get out. Don't be so disrespectful. His Majesty Duel tried to help Gigantos fight against humans. I am a human, but before that, I am a man who wishes the coexistence of all species. Don't you like peace? <laughs> Me, Kongol. Everybody dead. Kongol alone. Then come with us? Is this something in Kongol's heart? Then is that the truth of my uncle Dewell? I have something to do. I go now. Okay. Oh. Oh, the cheesy dialogue. Emperor DeWell said, strong leader is required to make equal world. Strong leader needs strong power. Kongo will get strongest power. Dart needs Kongo, so Kongo go. Kongo, what are you talking about? Wait for him here. Oh, is he about to fight his brother or something? Yeah. So, you came. Brother, I became stronger. I see. Brother the strongest. Kongle admire brother. Brother Kongle's pride. <laughs> I see. Brother. Kongol needs power to help Dart to save world. I see. Kongol, he's just so straight and to the point. Love it. Brother, Kongol overcomes now. Kongol overcomes brother. You already said that. <laughs> oh. Snap. Zero MP. Oh, do we? <laughs> we just never got his dragon spirit. It's like, ah, fuck Kongle. <laughs> What's wrong with you? You're so pathetically weak. Well, you did less damage than me, so... I don't know, man. Oh, I see. It's a similar mechanic. If you, uh, don't nail your additions, you just counterattacks. If I use, like, all my magic items... A psychedelic bomb! Acid. Ooh, okay. Whoa. Thunder, dark. Light. Uh, we'll go with light. Hey, okay, not too shabby.
They just hire like one guy to do one one uh, recorded voice line. Like, yeah, we need you to. So basically, you're you're a giant. <laughs> I don't even know how you would pitch that to someone. You're a giant's brother. He's always perceived himself to be weaker than you. We need you to give us a war. Give us your best war. <laughs> oh man. What's up with the trophy names? The trophy names are even weird. Kongle, a hero. The strongest hero of Gigantos. Brother. Go to the people who need your power. Brother, Kongle is... To fulfill desire is the power of destruction. To care for others is the power of truth. You receive the power to overcome Endora. The strongest power. Kongle, the pride of Endora. Well done. Brother. What is this? The Dragoon Spirit of the Golden Dragon. It's for you. Oh, what? <laughs> what? I didn't even realize that was a thing. So, if you, if you just refuse to get, to get his Dragoon Spirit, it just... The game is like, all right, we're gonna give it to you. You conquered it, didn't you? Did you just refer to my brother as it? Brother praised Kongle. First time for Kongle to praise. Kongle happy. <laughs> But what does the moon want to show us? It's not a moon anymore. It's the flesh of the god of destruction. And what the god of destruction wants to show us is annihilation. So it didn't entice us with gambling or drugs? What? No god of destruction I ever heard of. <laughs> Let's go. We gotta look for Dart and Rose. Oh! We can actually go down here. That is hilarious that the game just gives you that. Oh, by the way, here's a dragoon spirit that I happen to have. Oh, and there's the, like, best armor for Kongle just right there, too. Sweet. Nullifies damage due to earth-based attacks, but... I mean, his magic defense is already so low. Oh, shit. That's actually really good. Okay. Like, do we want his magic defense to be any... Lo like, look, in comparison to Miranda's. Jesus, dude. His magic defense is, like, the lowest. Why would we want to reduce that anymore? Kongle want to achieve strongest power. Kongle need to raise magic defense. <laughs> uh, all right. Okay. Is this? Wait, what? We're back here? The hell? Um. 
Oh, I see. I see it. It took us back here because we're rerouting to... Um, what's his face? Whatchamacallit, the who's a what's it? You don't see people who you shouldn't see. You see people you have to see. Damn. That's that's deep right there, actually. It's real deep. We couldn't find Dart anywhere. Hmm. Maybe it's better to wait for them somewhere rather than just blindly look around. <laughs> Then let's wait here. This town's the only place there are lots of people. Yes, let's wait in this town where there are figments of our imagination or manifest manifestations of our heart. Yeah, let's let's wait there. Seems like that's the right thing to do. Let's wait in this simula simulation of our mental projections. Let's just chill. Alright. I understand that we lost everybody because the dragon attacked us, but why? Why did your vassal dragon attack a throne? Was it to bring the two of us here? The place filled with dragons? I think. We will find out soon. Let's go. Either to destroy the Virage Embryo, or to fight against Zeke. I need everybody with me. Rose. Don't be so shocked. I trust everybody too. Rose, what are these? This is a baby dragon. It was called a pseudo-dragon. seems everything, including the future and past, exists here. My favorite pseudo-dragons didn't make it to the present age, but I am encountering the past now. But we don't have time to be sentimental, let's go. I didn't take you for the sentimental type, Rose. Calling me over there. Okay. Jeez. here soon. Hush, hush, hush. 
Oh yeah. Oh nice. Yeah, I forgot about that um like insta kill thing that she has on her weapon. Burning wave. About uh, this way. Hmm? <laughs> Ah, so that's how we get that item. And can we just jump down? Sweet. Another burning wave. Oh, Michael! Dragon. Oh, I actually hurt a little. Yes. Go. Not a Taylor Swift dragon. Our oh, Rose about to die. Ouch. Damn, how are the... I mean... How much speed do these guys have? Why are they getting to attack so many times? God damn it. What the... Bitches. All right. All right. Fucking around now. means business when she raises an octave.
Okay. Uh, four twenty. So bad. It's all bad, man. with fear now. Fantastic. Nailed it. Alright. Oh, hey! Got a level up out of that. Not bad. Not too shabby. Um, damn. Ah, uh, we really using our mind purifiers on that. God damn it. <laughs> All right, we are nearing the end of this session. Um. Damn, I don't know if we're gonna have. Let's try it. I don't know if we're gonna have enough time. I knew it. I know this place. It's where I met Michael for the first time. Darkness Dragon. Sorry, we don't have time. Winglings are mighty. Mighty enough to annihilate us and the entire species. In order to liberate humans, we have to sacrifice you, dragon. Now is the time to decide. Extinction or war? We choose war. The dragon spirit left by the darkness dragon, and this newborn dragon will be the spearhead of the war. This baby needs a name. Black Burst Dragon, Michael. <laughs> How about Michael? <clears throat> Rose's Vassal Dragon, the Darkness Dragon, the Black Burst Dragon, Michael. It's a good name. <laughs> so now we can go. The real war has not started yet. Oh shit. Alright, we got like four minutes to defeat this guy. <laughs> oh, cool. Alright, we have Dart in our party too. Sweet. So... Oh, he just... I was gonna say, he just, like, 
took out half of Rose's health in one attack. Um, light. Light is going to be effective, I think. Let's use all the all the magics. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's cool. Oh, he's just like immune. Fucking sweet, dude. Michael, it's me, Rose. Don't you recognize me? It seems not to be working. It's out of control, just like last time. He forgot the pride of the dragon and turned himself into a mere raving beast. It has a wildness even beyond that affair, Brand. Damn! <laughs> Darkness cannon on his back. That's pretty cool. I mean, I guess we're guard until something else happens, because you can't damage him. Then. Uh. really hoping we could get through this in one video, but I think what a dragon it yields to neither sword nor magic. The darkness dragon is the strongest dragon of all, having the best attack and defense along with having the best agility. I don't need to hear about it. Is there any way to defeat him? No. Yeah, they just had to make this uh, this little fight super hard for some reason. Michael's shell is special armor for the Darkness Dragon. It repels any attack by the enemy. What should we do? There is only one blind spot. What is it? Tell me now. Uh, and then we gotta wait. Of course. Hmm. There is only one b blind spot, but it'll have to wait five turns. Alright, we're approaching the end of this uh, video.